Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Fishing World. And today we are going to go to another part of England. Uh, where should we go? Oakwood, Misty... Oh, actually Oakwood is the only place we can go. Let's go fishing and then, uh, yeah, let's do morning fishing here. What should we try? You know what? We have a lot of tadpoles. We will go with tadpoles. We have 1200 bucks to our name, which is not enough. Because if I go to buy a better one, we have a 4.5 kg right now, I believe. Yeah, so 2.2 to 9 kg are locked out. <laughs> oh boy, okay. Uh, tadpoles, let's see, there we go. So last episode was the best one. Yeah, we got a lot of good stuff. This one, uh, oh, I apologize. This, oh, there we go. This one, let's see how this goes. Okay, okay. Or a tiny little fish, but for some reason it's pushing <clears throat> our setup here. What is this going to be here? It is a dace and it's a new record. So this is the biggest dace we've ever caught. Interesting. Okay. Over there. Cast. And then if we keep getting the same fish, I will change the bait. Simple as that. Oh man, this is a, this is a tiny fish. You know what? It's not a fish. It's a loot. It's treasure. Because you don't see the shadow of the fish. A doll. What a creepy doll. Wow. That is creepy. Don't want that doll. Uh, we are like almost le through level 14 as well. I don't know. I remember last episode we got to level 14, I think. Then all of a sudden we're already through level 14, so... Oh, is this a... Uh, it's an okay sized fish. Oh wow, it just went right through the gravel. Ah, oh, a crucian carp, and that is our very first crucian. Look at how cute it looks. So, uh, smallest, second smallest bait size. Ooh, level up. Level 15. We get bread and blood worm. Aha, come on, come all. Okay, let's cast once more with this before we change the bait. Uh, wasn't there spin fishing in this game as well? Or no? I have to check. After we catch this fish, we will check what uh, if spin fishing is a thing here. Guys, please don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, comment below all those buttons and keys and clicks. Really appreciate it. Another small fish here. Uh, Dace. Okay, Dace is boring. So let's go ahead and uh, let's use dough. 23 pieces. Then we have corn we can use. Oakwood Point is where we're at. I want to catch an interesting fish. Come on, give me something interesting. So far that cute little crucian was the only new thing. Ooh, big. Big, big, big. Big fish. Oh yes. There we go. That is the fish I wanted. Well, not particularly. I just wanted an interesting fish. And this is an interesting fish. A 1 kg barbel. I will take it. That's our very first one as well. Wow, look at that. This is the smallest size bait. It's the smallest cat size to the largest. So... <laughs> On this bay, we got a 1kg. Wow, what is this, 80? 80th fish? 
All right, one or two more throws. Actually, this is our new bait, right? So not even we're using tadpoles. I thought we were using tadpoles still, but uh, no, it's dough. Maybe we might get another barbel here. Hopefully we get something different. It bothers me when you don't even reel it in. Like you just stop. Is it taking out line or is it just like stopped? Again, sound of nature, ducks and all that stuff is uh, it's really nice. We get 16 bucks for catch. All right, one last time. I think all we're going to get is barbels on the dough. Yeah, it seems all of these are barbels. Because they're all nice, chunky sized. Damn. 1.1 kg. We gotta catch one more. Well, that was instant. Damn. Too many sheeps bay in the background. I'm gonna lose this guy as well. He's too jumpy. I don't like it. Okay, he died pretty quick. That's good. 1.438 kg. Wow, this guy was an easier one to catch and he was the biggest one as well. Very nice. So let's go ahead and equip corn because we have plenty of that. Let's see where to cast out oh, right here. There must be a farm right behind me. <laughs> Damn. I, I, uh, I struck too soon. There we go. Oh, it's a tiny little fish. Give me a carp. Give me a mirror carp or something. I want to see how that looks in this game. It is a cute little minnow. Okay. Not really what I'm looking for, but... Uh, it's too bad we cannot convert that into bait. You know what? That... Like, if you catch a minnow and you cannot turn it into live bay, which are also minnows, uh, then it's not... Like, it... How, how do you call it? I, I, I want to word it right. Uh, it separates the good fishing games from the bad or average fishing games, I would say. If you cannot convert live minnow that you caught, that are the right size to be turned into live bait, then it is not a great game. Or at least one negative point for that game. Because, come on, it, it it's a fishing game. It, this is what we do in real life as well. Okay, so corn uh, actually sucks pretty bad. We will not try that. Um... Dragonfly? Sure. We will cast and try that as well. Where, where, where? Fishy surface. Come on, let's go. Really? Oh, there. Finally. Damn. I do like it. It's a mountain in the back. It's another mountain range in the behind. Uh, it's forested. It's just really nice. And the water has a small animation. 
uh, everything else does not exist. It's just a painting. It's you can see it's clearly the art style is meant to be like that. Uh, besides animated water, we have animated like seeds, plant seeds that are pollen, I guess you would call them lying around. There's also flies above the water. And I think that's pretty much it in terms of animation and making it look uh, alive visually. Oh, wow, that's a big fish. And then audio does the heavy lifting. Wow. We got a 2.5 kg chub on this new fish and a hefty size. What? Oh, man, we are doing good. Wow, look at that. That's like halfway through. That's more than halfway through into getting a big chub. Damn, we might get in trouble here. Challenge complete. Catch a 2 kg chub using dragonfly. Okay. Catch a 0.454 kg crucian carp. We did catch a tiny little crucian carp. Catch 8 pike. Catch 12 rainbow trouts. Tranquil retreat. Maybe someday I'm gonna have to figure out how to catch rainbow trouts. And go to Tranquil Retreat. Where is that? River Store. I think we've already been here. We can go back there again. Oh, look at that. Catch a grayling at Serene Sanctuary. Oh, you need a boat. Uh, Roach, Perch, Mirror Carp. We haven't discovered Mirror Carps yet, but where are they? That's what I want. Brown Trout and Misty Banks. Ooh. Brown trouts are on and but what do they want? 15 brown trouts. You know what? Some of these are kind of easy because they want one type of fish irregardless of size, if that's even a word. And all we need is to use the bait we've already discovered. So maybe next episode. Ooh, ghost carp. Wow. Maybe next episode we can uh, start targeting some of these fish. Well, it's catfish, koi carp, eel, sandy, big bertha. That's not happening. But uh, you know what? I'm happy for that. Okay. That gives me a purpose finally. Uh, we are level 16. We have doe and ant. That doe was gold colored for some reason. Let's cast this out again. Wow, look at that throw. Epic. And then after this, we are going to try one more different type of bait. Holy moly, that is a massive fish. Good thing we cast it so close. Come on, dude. You're right here. How can you tell me? Yeah. 2.1 kg chub again. <laughs> this bait is scary, so let's maybe not use it. Let's use ant. We have 20 ants in our pants. No. I accidentally clicked uh, to the right here. Oh god, again? You know what? It's okay. It's so close. Oh, it's a tiny fish. Let's reel it in. It's a mi- oh god, not again. Minnows. Leave me alone, minnow. There we go. That's a good throw. Uh oh. What's a tiny fish again? How are you pushing me so hard? A tiny fish, that's a fighter. That fish is on roids. No, it's a decent sized fish, actually. <gasps> it's a brown trout. Oh my god, that's a 1 kg brown trout. <gasps> I wonder, guys, if this is sort of like uh, the other game. 
uh, My Fishing World. I forgot the name of that game. Uh, in that game, it's all about your casting distance. At Like if you cast close, you're going to get specific types of fish on, you know, one lure uh, bait. If you cast a little like 15 meters out, it's going to catch certain types of fish. So I wonder, let's try there again and see if we catch a brown trout. Okay, we did not cast that far this time. Because we we tossed a uh, ant close to the shore and we got a minnow, which is worthless. Then we cast it really far and we got a brown trout. How like those are such different fish, different size. Uh, maybe it's RNG or maybe there's actual truth to it. Maybe distance does matter. I could be wrong, however, I don't know. I'm gonna have to Google this if I ever remember to. Oh, wow. 2.5 kg brown trout. What? Let's cast there again. If we get brown trout again, what we're going to do is we're going to cast close by and see if we get a minnow again. And we will know at certain distances you get certain fish. That's kind of a small fish. Slowly reeling it in. There we go. Look at that. Oh my god. So this cast is gonna be the one that tells us. That proves our point or this proves our point, unproves our point, shatters our dreams. I don't know. So we have to catch a minnow here. That looks like a huge minnow if it is. I don't know if that's a minnow. That is a minnow. <gasps> oh my god, I can't believe it. I think I just discovered this myself. So, guys, on Ant, on this map that we're at, Oakwood Point, uh, if you cast all the way to the end here, you're gonna get brown trouts. If you cast over close by, you're gonna get minnow. Maybe in the middle, you'll get another fish. And I think that's the same thing for all different baits. Like using a dough, if I cast it here, I got barbels. Maybe if I cast it further out, I, I would get something else. Maybe closer, I would get something else. That is very interesting and it's worth Googling. Maybe people have guides. Hey, if you wanna catch this fish on this point, you need to use this bait you know cast it close uh, if you want this fish cast it there maybe that's actually a thing i don't know or maybe this was just complete um rng and uh what do you call it coincidence i don't know but it's worth investigating further if you know please comment below that is going to be it for this episode thank you so much for watching i'll see you next time until then like subscribe comment below bye guys